Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of FTB Beyond. And today I yep, wrong button. Uh today I thought we could go ahead and try getting the upgrades for those machines cuz especially for the energetic infuser. I think we might want to break that down first. Just the hardened upgrade kits. We need bronze gears, which, let's do that one. Good, I think we can get all of them in one shot. Yep. Well, that didn't take long. Ah. It's just going faster. A little bit. Let's see about making the next tier up while we're here. What what all do we need for the reinforced? Electrum and a silver gear. Well, the silver gear shouldn't be too awfully bad to get. Yeah, we got plenty of silver. While we're here, we might as well make all three of them all at once. And then, what what else do we need? An electrum? I think we can make one. A thermal expansion? Fused quartz. Do we have any? No. Not quite enough. Okay, let's see. What do you need for the um, electrum? The Electrum Blend, which is silver and gold. How much gold do we have? That's the other thing we're running out of, is gold. Gold and silver. And fortunately, we're only going to be able to do the one. But, that's okay. Yeah, that's why I was thinking about doing the pig spawner, because we keep running out of oops. I have everything else. Alright, we got that. We need just need two fused quartz. Quartz. Might have to make another another run. I think that's enough to complete one. Yeah. Alright. Particularly we want our uh, energetic infuser since we're using the jetpack method of flight. One reinforced upgrade. Hunter RF attack, which is a lot better than it was. What does it take to make the next tier? The hardening the signalum. Oh, yeah, we're nowhere. We're nowhere near that. And you know, electrum gear. Well, I think that's about as far as we're gonna get that. <coughs> hmm. I suppose we could go and do some building too. Come on. I know your your butt is fat, but it's not that big. Uh from testing I can confirm that stuff does in fact the snad in this pack is working correctly. Also, you have to have a block under it, otherwise it does fall like sand. Just get a partial section of wall here. So I'm thinking th uh, three wide, which put the other side right there. Do we want to put it there or maybe over one? Let's try over one. Just temporarily. Put it there. 
And of course, we're going to want to chisel some of it, which we actually have a bunch in storage at the moment. Uh, yeah, let's, let's go ahead and grab that. Grab some of you. And then I was thinking uh, 10 high on the wall. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I remain ten of these up to about there. How's that look? Eh, maybe a little shorter. And even terrain. Yeah, I think we're going to go a little shorter than that. Let's try eight. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight and then cut these off. Yeah, I think I think that that fits. Let's see how our jetpack is doing as far as charge goes. It should be charged doing a lot faster now. As for the top tier, I don't think we're gonna get the top tier going simply because, well, by the time you can get to top tier, we should be able to have other forms of flight. The other thing with doing nether stars is that you can get wyvern armor. Uh, in order to fly with the wyvern armor, you have to have a, an angel ring. You have to have an angel ring. The jetpack kind of... Well, for all the draconic armors to work correctly, you have to have the full set. And if you don't have the full set on, you don't get the full protection benefits. So there is that. And I'm I'm thinking that what I'll do, what we could do for the, as far as where the borders are, is go ahead and follow, well, not the borders, the, uh, the terrain changes. Go ahead and follow the terrain a bit. Uh, this is not this side with the port on it. It's on the other side, over there. All right. I heard an enderman. He's underneath us. Can we get to him, though, is the question. Is he just down here? Where the heck is he? Uh, there's uh, underground caves, and I'm not sure exactly where they are or how to get to them. <coughs> Let's see. All right, let's see if we can find it. Ah, there it is. All right. Let's tickle some Enderman. I did not know this cave was here. Did we get it? No. Nope, didn't get any heads. We're still working on that one. There's my hole. There it is. There it is. Go ahead and plug our hole. Put that away. Let's see. When we were distracted there, we were we were trying to get more juice going. Put that away. Uh, 
Alright, let's see. Put the dirt away. Mob drops away. Alright, back to what we were working on. Anywho, before we were interrupted there. The interesting thing here is going to be how do we make sure both sides of the wall follow the same path? I would like to have the wall even across this way, even if it's not even going that direction. So, actually we need to... If we're going to do this right, even though no one can actually see it, you go ahead and fill in all the holes, because that's what we do. Ah, it goes down even further here. Oh, that's going to be fun. We don't have aqua affinity yet. Oh yeah, now I remember what I was going to do. There was some other technical stuff to do, but I forgot to set it up. We don't really need that. Technically, yes, they can spawn there, but they don't, usually. At least they haven't been. Alright, so we got this wall going up here. And then I th think it carries on down to here, and then it's this level. Okay. Need more cobble. Now, now I remember what I was going to do. Um, we need to get Silk Touch on something. Because I'm thinking about setting up the vo Void Ore Miner here. Uh, there is also the Void Dimension. Uh, at simple... Simple Void. Uh, four Eyes of Ender, Obsidian, or Block of Diamond. We could probably make that, but... Um, getting power to it would be the problem. Let's see now. At... Environmental tech, because we can craft the hardened stone, and we don't need the solar particularly. I was thinking what we could do. Yeah, iron, quartz, and or and diamond, but we need silk touch, and we're also gonna need a ton of gold. But in the meantime, we can at least get silk touch on something. Let's see now a book. We do have a book and quill. Originally, I was gonna. Put some more enchants on my armor, but I uh, lapis. And I believe it's a slime ball gets you slick touch. Go ahead and put our cobblestone bricks away because we don't really need that. Has to be the regular slime. Okay, not a problem. <coughs> Just go grab some more. And the interesting thing with the Tinker's slimes is that if you put them in the nine or in the full grid, that is curious because usually these things. Huh. Yeah, I can grab that. Uh, if you put the slime balls in a 9 by 9 you'll get the vanilla slimes that out of it. Ow. Okay, that's close enough. We don't need the... So you put that in there and you get regular vanilla slime balls. There we go. Slick touch. Go ahead and put things away. I just wanted to grab the sapling. No reason. Don't need it. Oops. Yeah, let's go ahead and put it on map pick. I think we have enough levels for that. If not, I can go mining for more levels because. We have that well-established enchant. Ah, suck touch. 
Alright, the hard part is going to be getting the actual ore blocks. But, otherwise, I think we're good. I'll grab that. I'll go ahead and grab two stacks of that and a stack of that. Because I want to finish off that section of wall, at least getting the wall part of it. Uh, not necessarily the cap for it. That's something to do with this particular pack. Um, actually, I've been finding that happening in other 1.10 packs as well, where it sort of hitches. I'm not sure why it's doing that. Uh, this pack is the worst offender for that, but... That's alright. Not necessarily finish off the wall, but uh, get out through there marked out. Could go hunt Intermin, but it's almost morning, so. But yeah, something like that. You want it to be fairly tall and imposing, but you don't want it to be overwhelmingly imposing, because then nobody will notice the main castle itself. Of course, as always, I'll be getting this and uh, the rest of the actual wall built off camera. But I just thought I'd bring you guys to here for that. And I think what I might do in this case is go ahead and get the walls built up except for the cap. And then bring you guys in when I do the other part. Or maybe do that in a, a future episode and what am I doing. That doesn't go there. That goes in there. We'll put it in the right place eventually. But, in any event, I think I'm going to go ahead and call it here. Go ahead and make it a little bit shorter of an episode. Uh, if you did enjoy the episode, do be sure to hit that like button. And, if you really enjoyed it, you can click on my little Minecraft guy's face on the screen. And you can also, uh, to subscribe, and you can also check out some of the other videos of mine on the screen as well. And, I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.